Hey y'all, Kate Price is here. So here is your September 2019 mid-month reading. Scorpio, Kate Price is here. So let's do it. So Scorpio, hmm. I feel like some of you guys may be holding off making a decision or giving someone a decision. And you might tiptoe out the dough. You might tiptoe out the dough only because... I feel like you may care about this person, but you don't see them fitting into your life. You know, you go another direction and you're really not there. There may be someone you have your eye on already that you may have let go in the past. Okay. Maybe. Maybe somebody you let your, you had your eye on. Okay. Now, um, I think that there is, oh, why do I feel that way? Hold up. I think that there is going to be some kind of um, invitation, is what I hear. An invitation to move your life forward and to be with somebody else. You want to, I feel, you know, but there's some apprehension about moving forward, even though you want to so damn bad. I don't know what you're scared of. Maybe you worry about this next person. Okay, so I hear some of you guys are worried about taking a leap, okay? I mean, maybe you are. You know, I'd be worried about taking a leap as well, but not really because I don't give a shit. I'll do it. I mean, I will fucking do it. Um, you uh, may feel like you're rushing into something else with some other person. You rush, 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 and you're not really sure how to do this or how to make this thing work, but someone is getting rushed and someone's getting held the fuck off. Maybe you've been holding this thing off for a long enough time that you feel maybe you're hitting your deadline. Maybe you're hitting, you know, you've been hit your stride, you know, two years ago. And now you're hitting your deadline. It's like, you know, maybe you have a certain amount of time to, to get engaged with someone. And you feel like, I better do this now, you know, or you feel like you want it now because it's time for it. It is time for it. Maybe you're going to skip the whole engagement part and just get married. I mean, you know. You may go ahead and just tie the knot with somebody, get your old ball and chain, you know, you may, you know, clink, clink, you know what I mean, on your ankle and just throw away the key, you know, you might do that. I feel like, okay, so what I hear, oh, that's funny. So it's time, it is time, you know, and then I see Rafiki from Lion King, you know, he said it is time, you know what I mean, for, you know, somebody to come back and shit, you know, so maybe it's time for you to make a comeback with this person. I feel like you feel Somebody in a situation feel it is time to either get married or to be with this person the way you're supposed to. No more bullshitting. No more games. This is it. I love you. You love me. We don't just love each other. We in love with each other. Okay. There's a big ass fucking difference. We in love with each other. And I think we should get married. So let's go to the courthouse. And get our license, okay? Because it's that time. Let's just do it. Get the license. And if the judge there, get married there. And we have reception later. Or just get the license and shit. And we can call whoever we want to the house, whatever. And we can just do it. And then worry about have a celebration some other time. I really feel this may go down. All right? So be uh, very afraid. I think you realize that. You want to go ahead and do this. So it's just time. Like, this is time. Okay. That, it is time. I'm sorry. I keep saying it, but it, I mean, somebody need to hear this shit. Okay. Move forward. It's time to move forward. It's time to go for what it is you love. And, you know, maybe some of y'all scared to be in a relationship, you know, and, and it's been difficult for you. Maybe. Okay. Let me just say this to you right now. If it's somebody who's full of shit. And you with them and they're still full of shit and they've been full of shit all these years and they're a liar and they all this stuff because i didn't you know you're scorpio so i know you exposed to this kind of bullshit you know all the time these liars and all this stuff or maybe it's because you can see it so easily because you are a scorpio you know you can see right through their ass but um if you in a situation where you're dealing with that don't Okay, just don't deal with it because it's bullshit and shouldn't nobody deal with that that kind of shit because you were knocking my fuck over the head and then all of a sudden you in prison, you know, and just, we could just not be bothered with the ass. 
Okay? So you don't want to do that. You don't want to do orange, new, black type shit, okay? You just don't want to do it. Matter of fact, I watched that, okay? Finally, I watched this last season. I was mad as hell. How the fuck are you going to turn the show? Okay, anyway, I'm sorry. How are you going to make the last? Okay, so, um, you're ready to start new. You're ready to open up and you're ready to give your all to your love. Are they ready to give it to you? Because you realize this person make you stand up. This person make you get about to share, okay? They have you on the edge of your seat, all right? That's how you in love this person. I'm trying to get down in your business, okay? I'm trying to know what time you eat, sleep, and go to the bathroom. I'm talking to Scorpios now. Come on now. This is not crazy to y'all. Eat, sleep, go to the bathroom. How do you feel? Why do you feel that way? Why would you ask me that? I'm just going through my Pluto first house. <laughs> first. So I know that y'all are the same way. Why'd you ask me that? You know, you want to know the reasons behind everything. The reason behind this, that you want to be with this person is probably because you love this motherfucker and they love you too. And I feel like you know, some of y'all going to be trying to not only because you feel like it's the last time I'm not doing this. You mind or you dead. I'm sorry, y'all. I'm just telling you how i feel okay just letting them getting out there this is not crazy talk now if i was talking to a libra they'd be like oh my god she's so terminal no i'm talking to scorpio so y'all understand me we, we here we here we here right we right here right because i understand this um yeah you might die <laughs> i mean Technically, I can't kill you because I'll get caught. Maybe 100 years ago, I'll get away with it. But no. Okay, so if you feel like you're going to kill a motherfucker because they ain't doing the right thing, just be done with them. Just be done with them because you don't want to be in prison. Being semi-senor or sen- senor, you know what I mean? Senorita. You know what I mean? You don't want to do that. All right? I mean, maybe you do, but you, know, you don't want to do it in prison. So... Get ready because I feel like some of you guys are going to be getting married or somehow locking it down but i really see a marriage license in somebody's future around here if you're not dealing with somebody this shit may come out the blue out the blue out the blue you may go ahead and do it you know maybe somebody you ain't seen in 10 years 10 20 years and then they come back y'all in love and shit y'all got some good hand hand and there it is you know it's marriage and it's togetherness and it's love okay so i think it's all i have for you scorpio much love to y'all and i will speak to you soon bye